What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to my Anno 1800 Let's Play series. On the last episode, we went against George Smith with quite the Navy, and uh, we also acquired some new islands and really just kind of expanded the empire. Um, and this episode, kind of off camera, what I just did is I cleaned up the trade routes a little bit, um, put cargo ships on instead of clippers, so trade should be a little more efficient as well. So that adjustment will be kind of nice. Um, my trader's having a little bit of an issue, but I can just remove this one from it. So these trade routes, some of them have, are having a little issues just because... Just because, sorry about that, I had to, uh, had to cough a little bit. But, um, just because the, uh, you know, all the combat and stuff, all the, you know, George Smith killing a bunch of our ships, um, really disrupted our trade, so... Anyways, let's go to the New World. So what I was working on before was taking this little navy here and taking over George's last island in the New World. Um, I think that will be a really good next step because this island is actually pretty huge. And it's got, I guess, some decent fertilities as far as needs go. Um, but it doesn't have corn, so I guess that's kind of not so good. But it's okay. We'll deal with it. I don't think I'm going to really expand it much. I'm just going to use it for probably tobacco and cocoa. I'm just going to make a lot of chocolate here. So um, it'll work out fine. And then Hawaii, maybe I'm going to, let's see, what, what are these? This is all coffee. Okay. So I'll probably make the coffee a little more efficient. And um, maybe the, actually I might make the sugarcane more efficient too. But we're producing quite the surplus of sugarcane, I do believe. Let's check that real quick. Um, but yeah, we are producing quite a surplus. So, um, I don't know, maybe I can do without some of these, you know. Um, the storage is full on some. I can maybe delete one. Then see where we're at now. Because, I mean, what's the point of having all of it? Yeah, so we're at 42 now out of 39. So that's good. And then if I make a couple of these, um, I can delete a couple, then make some with uh, tractor barns, and it'll be good. So our fleet is slowly approaching. And this fleet is not a junk or throwaway fleet, but... I don't really care if a lot of these ships die. So let's just um, hurry up here and do what we're intending to do. Get into combat with this stuff. Alright. So yes, we are getting into combat. That's okay. So I'm just going to go ahead and attack all this stuff and uh, see how it goes. I should be able to take the island pretty much no problem. Although my battlecruiser is getting really messed up. Yeah, I'm going to lose a battlecruiser for sure. But it's not that big of a deal. Yep, lost one battlecruiser. I still have one left. And then I still have my ship of the line and my frigates. My monitor. My monitor is going to die too. That's okay. Oh, I forgot that uh, I didn't even see that repair that repair crane there. But I should have taken that out. I should have taken that out first. Obviously, that's like... The biggest deal, you know. But I don't know if I'm going to take this or not. Look at the island's really holding firm. Um, I guess we'll see. But it's weakened, so it must have... Oh, it's got other defenses over here. That's what I was missing out on. So I have my steamer over here. I might need more of an army. Or more of a uh, navy to take this. I'm not completely sure, but I mean... We'll see. I'll kill everything in this harbor and then see where it's at from there. Hopefully I can take it just by uh, killing this harbor. At least everything on the harbor. Yeah, it looks like it's really vulnerable. So I can take maybe another weaker harbor, which would be... Oh, that other harbor is the only one that's pretty weak. Oh. This one has a couple mounted cannons, so I might be able to just swing around to this one. And attack that one. Or this one here. This one has three mounted cannons, so I might have a better chance. Yeah, so it's it's losing it just from killing these buildings here. So that's good. I hope hopefully I can take it just from doing all this. We'll see, but I'm not gonna bet on it, you know. Um, but anyways, I wanted to say, uh oh, ship construction finished. Oh, yep. My cargo ship's being built. That's good. So what I wanted to say was um, I appreciate all the support in the previous episodes. 
Um, I think my views have dropped a little bit, but it's, you know, it, it's expected. You know, YouTube fluctuates a bit, it seems. Um, but yeah, thanks for all the comments, too. I really like talking to you guys, and I really encourage you to comment more if you can. Um, it means a lot to me. It really kind of gives me no motivation to continue the series. And it uh, feels good. Feels good. So let's bring the uh, Navy onto this side. So I think they'll be fine to go ahead and do that, and uh, I should be able to take this island, no problem. Um, the timer hasn't started ticking yet, but I know there is quite quite a timer for some of this. So I completely destroyed that harbor, and I'm going to move to the north side and take out this harbor. Um, but yeah, so um, while we do that, I did fix up my trade routes. I do have to fix up my supply chain as well, though. So um, I'm looking forward to that. Um, I do have to build up Diego Garcia just a little bit more. Um, so this one will supply rum and uh, coffee and cocoa. So this one will be another really huge productivity uh, island for me. Kind of similar to Hawaii, I think. But uh, let's get some more residents in here. Resume the attack or your siege yep, will I will resume the attack. Um, I think it's already happening, actually. Yes, it is. So my ships are really moving quickly. And the sail ships here, as you can see, they really uh, they move quickly when they've got the wind behind them. Arguably, actually, a little quicker than uh, than even the steam ships, at least without uh, proper movement items, the steam ships. But anyways, they don't need the wind to move, so that's why they have the advantage. Okay, once again, need to attack this repair tower, which I'm not too worried about. The monitor died. One of the frigates died as well. Um, yep, another ship is gone. Let's pick up that item. So what harbor is under attack? Your oh, this one at Hawaii. I don't know why that would be being attacked right now. Um, okay. So George uh, lost that big island of Otisville. So we will conquer the island. The game has to think about it a little bit because it's got a lot to do. There we go. So this is actually a massive island. Yeah, this is <laughs> my goodness. That what a huge island. Um, so the shore that's closest to everything is this one, which the trade post is already on. So I think this will this will suffice. Um, photography quest. Which what does she want? Um, picture of her harbor. Sure thing. Sure thing. That's an easy one. A quick uh, twelve thousand. Nothing wrong with that. So what I want to do is build up Diego Garcia first, because this island is going to be a little more, nece more necessary with the needs going on. Um, so I'll go ahead and start doing a few things here just to get basic needs going, because I really don't want to have to um, worry about this. Uh, I don't want to have to worry about this island for needs. I don't want to have to supply it, you know. Um, from well, supply it with Hawaii because Hawaii is already dealing with its own needs. So, um, I think I can do that there with the houses. Hopefully, I'll just delete that first little row if it gets in the way of any shore buildings. So let's do that. Maybe we can make some more houses like here. I'm um, actually, you know, we can blueprint some stuff here. Um, just to make sure that I'm not... I don't know why I can't move. It says free coast needed, but I'm not sure why. That's really weird. Maybe I can move this one here. Okay. Yep. So I think I think I, I don't I can I can expand a little bit here beyond this. Um, it'll be okay to do so. So I'll bring the buildings up there. I'm really enjoying the series though, man. I've, I've had a good dose of combat, and I do like some combat, but man, I don't like dealing with the AI taking all my stuff. Oh, <laughs> she bought a share of Isle Royale. That is ballsy. That is really something else. Um, so my defenses are good here. Let's see if I can pick up any of these items that dropped, if they're still here. Oh no, they're gone. I think it was just uh, leftover debris from my old ship anyway. So it's not really a big deal. Um, so upgrading the harbor is going to take some resources. Looks like George didn't keep it upgraded, really. That's okay. 
So, um, go back to Diego Garcia. Okay, so things are coming in pretty good. Um, let's make sure we get our bananas going. And then, oh, we need to make sure timber's going too, though. Um, that's actually really, really important. So, how about, um, so this has a lot of oil too. So we can put, um, how about we put a, we put some timber back here for now. So I'll put one um, here. So let's go ahead and upgrade them. Hola. Just so we get them planting, you know, planting ahead of time. Let's get that one there. And then let's see if we can get this one. Okay, we can get that one 100%. So who's under attack? My cargo ship? Oh, yeah, so maybe I can put some defenses here just to defend my stuff a little bit. I think I will do that, but I really wanted to check and see if I have weapons here. If I do, that'll be great. But if I don't, which I'm thinking that I don't... Has ended. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not seeing um, weapons here at all, so... Okay, so I might have to set an escort for that ship, for my cargo ship. Which is fine. Um, she has two cargo ships for sale. Um, I think, well, I've already built quite a few, so I think I'll be good for now. Let's set an escort, though. How about we have my Perforium Battlecruiser escort the, uh, the cargo ship? I think that'll be good. So let's go back to Diego Garcia and then finish up the timber here. Because that is something that will need to be get need to go quickly. Because I'm going to use this island to exclusively supply probably Isle Rail. Hawaii will uh, exclusively support uh, uh, Crown Falls. So so yeah, um, let's put the warehouse right here. Let's put the road here. It's like another ship is under attack. Which one will it be this time? Same one? Yeah. Well, that's why I'm bringing up the uh, the Perforium Battlecruiser to uh, rendezvous with it. Perfect. All right. So they will. Uh, that trade route will be secure because that Battlecruiser will take out anything that comes against it. So let's build that. And then now we need a road to the harbor, which won't be that big of a deal. All we do, all we're going to do, is snake this. Uh, yeah, let's snake this road around. Yep. I really don't mind snaking it around. I don't think it looks that bad. It's just a coastal, uh, coastal little highway, you know? That's all it is. One bridge there. And then, I wish there was one to kind of snake it along the coast and, you know, not just like the mountainous area. But anyway, so we got the bridge there. We've got, uh... We've got the forest being planted. So, um, how about the timber? Let's put one there. Let's turn off blueprint mode because I'm just going to build these. Um, one there. Then since we're making rum, um, I think it'll be okay to just... Let's do two for now. Or actually, we can do, we can do four, but... Um, let's do four. Okay. We can do four, but what I wanted to do was uh, turn them off later. You know, pause them at least. So, okay. So that'll work. That'll be just fine for now. Um, so we do have a decent little population here now. Let's keep on building it up, though. Um, let's make sure a couple things are fulfilled first. Fish oil factory. Um, plantains need to get going. So this, this, this area right here is going to be perfect for our needs. Perfect. Absolutely. Um, so this is going to be another oil spot. I think I want to put plantains up here. I think that might be a good idea. So let's go ahead and build a bridge there. And then kind of snake this road along here. And snake this road along this way as well. So I hope that um, I hope that the music isn't too loud. I, I'm always worried kind of about uh, like copyright stuff going on. Um, I hope it doesn't happen this time. 
I guess time will tell. So, uh, we need ponchos soon, too. But, uh, I think what I can do here is... Actually, let's delete some of this road. And then see see how much of a operation we can get going in this little pocket here. So, let's blueprint mode this, actually. So, let's... Okay. I can probably fill up this whole spot here. Yeah, yeah. So I wonder if I could do this. 63 there. Yeah, I think I can, actually. I think that'll be good. It'll work for now, you know? Like, it doesn't have to be... Actually, I can fit a warehouse right here. And uh, plantain kitchens. So yeah, let's put it... Let's put the warehouse, like, right... Let's delete this road for now. Um, put the warehouse right there. The plantain kitchens will go... I could put them... Um, here and here. That way I can maximize some of this space. That feels good. Okay. Um... Whoa, Paka. What does that mean? Maybe it's a nickname for alpaca. All right, now I'm just gonna have a ton of plantains. Um, let's check this one. I actually kind of wanted to do this. Let's uh, remove. Let's adjust this to be a little more laid out. One twenty-five and three. Okay, now that's fine. So we're gonna have a lot of plantains going. Um, let's move the road here. Okay, we're gonna have a lot of plantains going, but that's fine. Um, oh, yep, need more oil there. There we go. All right, let's delete that for now. So they're gonna need also um, ponchos. So how about we get an alpaca farm maybe going right here? I think that would be that would be a good thing. So let's put let's do two poncho diners it's just so we can we have enough to really get our population going. Let's put one. Here, then we'll put one. Well, I guess let's move this. Let's get an alpaca farm going first. See how many we can fit in here. We'll put this, put the square. Let's put one here, actually. I want to fit this in as good as I can. So, okay. Yeah, it's not going to happen right here. Um, let's just delete this and then put the poncho darners right here so we can make utilization of this warehouse. Okay, we'll move the road here. Okay, so there's two. Um, now, let's take this road, kind of put it there. I know that that part of the road won't really be utilized, but I wanted to make uh, the alpaca farms kind of kind of stacked right here. Um so let's try one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I guess that'll work for now. I can't really think of a better way to do it. Unless I put unless I put one of these. Actually, let's delete one of these. And put this one there. Oh no, dang, it won't work. Unless I moved it up, you know. I could move it up. Unless I put this one here. Now, nah. Let's just leave it there for now. It's not a big deal. 16,000 coins from his Harlow. And look at our income. It's actually gone back up quite a bit. 24,000 from Barrel. Very nice. Um, let's go to Diplomacy and make sure Barrel's... Oh, she's actually... She's fine. She's absolutely fine. Um... So, um, ponchos are happening. They are coming in. Um, so the goods of our Hornaleros are looking really good. They're looking really good. We already have a fire firehouse here. Let's let's work on more Hornaleros, though. Like I said, I really want Diego Garcia to uh, flourish. Because I want that rum to flow. It's got, it's got big demands to keep up with, you know? 
Now I've already got tons of timber coming in. Like it's uh it's looking good. So let's build another group over here. We'll do a two by three. Another two by three. Yeah, that's fine. So this island is this island's growing really fast. Let's put another road right here. So I will need to get bricks like really, really soon though. Um, let's check on this warehouse. Let's upgrade it. Um, oh, I have a ton of bricks already here. So production, um, yeah, we're already, we're making a surplus. We're, we're fine. So we can probably upgrade some already. Actually, no, we can't. Okay, so it's because we're just getting our barrows. Um, that's fine. That is actually fine. Um, what I wanted to do was think about, okay, so I can get clay here. To me, transporters loading delayed. Okay, let's fix that. See, I get lots of, lots of timber coming in here. That's amazing. Needs are being satisfied. Okay, I think I can start upgrading. Yep. All right, now I have some more barrows here. And uh, I can actually brick some of the roads. It's amazing what you can do once you have like a lot of supplies already. Gonna brick this. I might actually build a hospital here too. Um, let's put some of these guys over here. Yeah, let's put them there. Um, boom. Okay, so what I wanted to do is put a hospital in because sicknesses are going to happen sooner than later. And I just want to have something here to uh, help them out. Let's make a little driveway for it. Okay, and then we need a police station as well. We can put one, let's put one maybe here. Let's move one of those houses. Move one there. Put a police station. How about, uh, will it fit here? No, it won't. It's okay. Put this road here to accommodate. Put this road to accommodate, or at least uh, the resident there. Okay. Actually, let's keep that one there. Um, let's put the uh, brick road down. All right, police station is down, perfect. Okay, now let's put down some more Hornelero houses. So all of our needs are taken care of here. Hopefully we won't have any riots, at least the police will take care of it. And uh, yeah, more Obreros, more Obreros. Okay, awesome. Um, so our population is doing really well here, although the the rum operations that we need to make will actually take quite a lot of resources. So um, let's continue to upgrade just a little bit. Okay, now we've got a good sizable chunk of our barrows here. So I wanted to make the uh, the clay operation in a place that's not too in the way, and I think this this qualifies for that. So um, let's put a brick factory here, one here, and then we can, uh, we need to bring some more bricks here anyway, so I'm just going to upgrade these. Put a warehouse uh, right here, and then maybe we can put some operations up here, you know, um, I think that'll be good. So how about we just, uh, we nestle this road up to the cliff. And uh, connect the warehouse, just like that. And then we can actually delete this road on this side. There, looking good. Okay, so um, so yeah, I didn't um, I didn't do propaganda, so my income dropped like crazy. But that's fine. I want my income to shoot up naturally anyway. And I've already got a sizable like little cushion here of money. So 
Now that I've got uh, bricks going here, I wanted to grab this uh, steamer and get some more materials to bring. Because what I will need is, yeah, I'm going to pick up a lot more bricks. Um, probably, do I have, how much, uh, how many motors do I have? I have 50 here. I'm going to keep them here in case I, well, because I will be upgrading the productivity, but I just wanted to get Diego Garcia, Diego Garcia really going. Let's get all those bricks. And how about some timber? Well, no, let's... Yeah, let's get the timber. All right. So we might have a timber shortage there, or a log shortage, but it happens. Oh, actually, no, we need... Does this place have weapons? Yes, it does. Bring it back. So this place does have weapons, but I wanted to make sure that I'm buying them. Buy one under 480. So I wonder if uh, Isabel here has something for me. Oh, just a, just a cargo ship. A few other things. Okay. That's fine. I know I do have resident quests here, but I am uh, kind of leaving that for now. All right. Let's bring these over. So Diego Garcia is looking really, really good. Um, so our Abreros aren't the happiest that's why that's why this is going to be well we're, let's just gonna let's just say we're not going to fulfill all their needs that's kind of tough to do um like early on in the island but we could bring slug machines and beer and stuff like that here with uh you know from our old world stuff but um that'll happen that'll happen a little later probably if at all so we could get rum going already actually um so that's my steamer coming up here um and this is so i don't know why i have another frigate carrying the rum is it this one no it's not that one um where is the f the one that's a frigate It's not the swamp rat. It's the Castilla. Okay, Castilla, what are you doing? Um. So I actually, okay, go here. I want the Constance. All right, Constance, come over here and take over for the uh, for the frigate. So once I once I do this, I, I won't. I think I, I mostly transition to cargo ships. Like that's gonna be it's gonna be my big deal here. But yeah, so I definitely need to bring some um, some motors here. So I'm gonna have a ship do that pretty soon. Um, let's go to the old world. Actually, I want to get. I'm thinking about getting another extravaganza steamer. Yes. Absolutely. So bring this to Isle Royale. Because I'm putting my cargo ships all on trade routes. So that's why I wanted extravaganza steamers. Just to just to kind of ferry things around. Um, let's put the weapons down here. Okay. This will be my new world one. So let's transfer the rum here. And then... Um, Reinforced concrete. Okay, that's so it's this one. Um, let's trash that one and then put the constants on there. Um, Herald 2, nope. Nope, not constants. Um, wait, is this one old sardine? This one is called constants 2. Oh, okay, okay. I sometimes have trouble with these names. Um, constants. That's the first Constance. Uh, Constance 2. Okay, yep, that one. Okay, now it's going. Let's take this frigate and uh, put it towards uh, the defenses of Diego Garcia. And then let's go to the Old World and grab some 
Um, yeah. Where's that extravaganza steamer? Oh, it's on its way. It's right there. Yep, so we're going to grab some... Uh, what the hell? I don't want any share debt from you. Yeah, she bought that share and it tanked my income. So they do have rum, but not too much of it. Okay, so I'm going to grab some uh, steam motors, um, some steel beams. So what does it take to make a tractor barn again? I've made so many of them, but I still just don't remember what it takes to build one. No more space here. Okay, so we need to go to a spot where... Ah, okay. So it costs, yeah, 20 steel beams and 10, um, 10 motors, so... Let's go to the old world and check on the steamer. Should be right here. Yep. There it is. So do I have a pier? Oh no, my pier's not there. Yeah, just my steam shipyard. Let's bring it over to my pier. So the large oil harbor is doing good here. Um, maybe we should upgrade it. Yeah. Upgrade the storage on a little bit, won't hurt anything. Um, so we're constantly out of rum, we're constantly out of, uh, clothing here. And I know it's because of the cotton fibers. I'm just not bringing in enough of it. Um, yeah, it's always out. So I need more cotton fibers and I need more rum here. Cotton fabric, sorry, not fibers. Um, and then, and then my engineer's needs will be met. Um, the rum is actually here, so that's good. But yeah, so let's get some stuff going, um... Where is the stuff? Okay. One, two, three. Um, where is the... Still beams are at the top. One, two, three. Alright, let's send that to... Um, Diego Garcia. So that's on its way. Good stuff. Um, let's go back to the new world. Since this is my developed island, I think I should go ahead and start with... Uh, okay, so I'm bringing that in. Let's put some uh, weapons here to defend against any any threats, foreign or domestic. There we go. Okay, so now that I have those, I want to build a little bit of storage here just to get a head start on it because I will need a lot of that. Okay, bring this frigate up a little bit. All right, Diego Garcia is looking really good. So I want to build some... I want it when I start building the rum, I want it to all be tractor barns. So I'm going to wait. Well, actually, I can blueprint it. I can definitely blueprint it. So this is a nice little shore here that I could maybe build a pier on. Can I build a pier in the new world? Oh, yeah, I totally can. Oh, yeah, I can build it here. Oh, amazing. I think I'm going to do that. Well, actually... This isn't as safe as this one. This has a nice natural harbor to it. So yeah, actually I'll wait on that. <laughs> but um, this is a nice huge area for rum and coffee and chocolate. And then this here can go just towards other things. Like I can probably put some bananas here or plantains. Um, but yeah, so the Hornaleros are in, in need of some more... Uh, population here so let's do that I'm making the population really huge here because because I really I really really need to make this another I need to make a good decent go at making this like Hawaii because Hawaii just is Hawaii is supplying my whole empire with rum right now and I need to make sure that I have two islands doing that because if I don't I'm really susceptible to shortages like I'm experiencing now. You can see my income just fluctuating wildly. It's because my luxury needs are not, well, they're being met, but intermittently. So it's not it's not the greatest situation. Um, so let's have, uh, where's that other steamer at? There it is. Let's grab some more bricks. I'm gonna fill this up. Oh, actually. Nope, bring it back here. Nope, nope, nope. Bring it back here. Um, we'll need steel beams and windows to upgrade that. We do have some windows here. Um, so how's my rum doing here, actually? Is it low here as well? 
It could be. See, I'm really, I'm really good on the cocoa, but the chocolate is, I don't know. Um, I'll figure it out. So the rum, yeah, the, so the rum's probably not producing actually at full capacity. I'll just de decline that one. Um, so the rum's not producing at full capacity because it's probably missing timber, or not timber, but logs. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, the log, the logs is uh, the restricting thing here. So you know, I actually, I actually could make a lot of logs on Guam. In fact, I probably should. That would help a lot. Um, so this is just plantains, which, which I'm supplying, right? Like it's, yeah, it's, I don't need all this here. Can I s turn this around there? No. I just put it there for now. Um, okay, so what I wanted to do is I'll, I'll trade logs to Hawaii. I think that'll be a good option. Um, because also I'm making timber there because I'm using it. But uh, that, that ship's going in. Um, but I can I can just have a ship. I have the cargo ship that's moving back and forth. It is well, actually where is it? People celebrate your leadership. Is it here? No, where is my, um, oh, I don't have a cargo ship dedicated to this area, actually. Um, so I'm going to get one to dedicate to it. Yep. So let's do that. Um, let's bring it over here. I'm going to trade logs to Guam. Or not to Guam, from Guam to, uh, to somewhere else. To Hawaii. So, um, timber, timber is coming in pretty nicely here, so I don't really need to worry about it. Oh, uh, the timber. But I think having a surplus of logs would be really helpful. So, um, I'm going to be trading a lot of them, so. Yep, blueprint mode. Blueprint mode off. Taking off the training wheels. Oh, no. Okay. Nope. Put one there. Put one there. Oh wow, I can put them pretty close without uh, interfering too much. Okay, can I put one like here? Hmm, kind of. Yeah, I can kind of put one there, okay. Okay, <clears throat> so that'll work. That'll work nicely. So I'm gonna be making a ton of logs here and I'm going to up the storage because I want to get a nice storage of logs. Oops, I didn't mean to upgrade. I just wanted to change the look. There we go. So now I have quite a huge storage of them. And what I wanted to do was, so I have this uh, this ship here. I wanted to just get this cargo ship and create a route. New world logs. Put this... Uh, the wild pigeon, right? Where is the wild pigeon? The wild pigeon, uh, goblin shark. So goblin shark will go on that. And then it's gonna go from uh, there to there. And it's gonna load logs. It's gonna load lots of logs. Everything it's got. There. There, so I'm glad I'm doing that. That really, that just needed to be done, you know? Um, okay. That's that's Dr. Hugo Mercier's island. Um, so Guam, Guam could just sit here 
and just harvest logs for me. I don't really need much out of it. Actually, it does have coffee. I don't have much space for the coffee, though. That's the only issue. I'm providing, it's providing a lot of rubber and cigars and pearls. So yeah, I don't really need coffee from there. That's fine. Um, Hawaii has a lot of herberos. Maybe I can downgrade some. I probably should. Yeah, let's try and downgrade those just a little bit. Okay. Just because I don't, I don't want, I want some Hornoleros sitting around too. Like I don't want to just, oh, here we are. Oh no. I thought that was the steamer for uh, carrying all the stuff that I want. Um, so let's go back to Hawaii and get some more bricks. Because I wanted to brick up all the roads here just to make everything, make sure all my villagers are getting their needs. All my workers, I mean, Hornoleros, whatever. Make sure they're getting everything they need. And then I will expand the population. Um, probably out to here. Well, not too much more out here. Um, right here, though, I'll definitely, I'll definitely finish up this side with uh, more population. So. An in one of your Put some there. Some there. Explosion in one of my factories. That's not good. It's probably in Hawaii because those that area explodes a lot. Oh no, heavy weapons actually. Oh, that's going to be expensive. Well, hopefully I have a fire nearby. I should, right? I mean, why wouldn't I? Probably because I'm an idiot. <laughs> um... Yeah, let's put one right here and there. So that way they can get to any of the coverage they need. Man, that sucks. I thought I had more, like, available. I thought I had some over here, but I guess not. Dang. So Isle Royale has quite a bit more space, actually. Like, it's, it's kind of impressive. I do have quite a bit of engineers. But yeah, my industrial area is actually, like, really sustaining me really well. Um, so let's go to the New World, and then um, once Isabel sells me a, sell, has another combat ship for sale, I'll buy it and assign that to... Oh, I wanted to grab more bricks. I'll assign that to uh, guard duty for the cargo ship that's bringing in all of the... Um, oh, here we go. All right, that's what I was waiting for. <laughs> okay, so like I'm pretty set with a lot of workers already here. Like a lot of uh, a lot of things have already fallen into place here because I was like pretty motivated to build it up. Um, so let's check on the needs here just to make sure everything's squared up. Uh, yeah, not at all. So we need more fried plantains. I just want to make sure like I get as many workers here as possible. So I need fried plantains and I need um, some tortillas. So. Let's work on that just a bit. Let's put one there. And make sure they're getting all the fish oil that they need. And then we need a plantain plantation. And that'll go, how about we make a bridge right here? And then we make a road that kind of weaves like this. Now we got to make sure it's okay. All right. So how about we put a warehouse like right there? Then we'll put a uh, plantain plantation here and fill this whole area up. And I, and I know what you're thinking. I, I could do tractors. Um, that's 128 actually. Wow. I could, I could do tractors here um, for the uh, plantains, but um, I'm going to stay away from that for now because I, I, I think that the rum is a little more important to get that started first, and then I'll kind of reassess the situation and see if I can uh, actually afford that. You know, actually uh, 
have the capacity with the materials to do that. So let's do that. Um, actually, this can be a nice gold deposit for me too. Very nice. Iorea has a little bit of a shortage. That is, uh, that is foreseen. I know about that. I am very keenly aware of that. So let's uh, make some more storage, actually. Because like I said, this island is going to be making a lot. A lot, a lot. So actually, let's make these into the open dockyards. I think that's pretty cool looking, you know? Okay. So there's some storage. Um, so what I could do... Uh, the oil is going to be kind of a pain here. Um, that's that's if I decide to actually get oil here. Let's delete some of this road. Okay. So, how about I put some... Actually, I might need more population over here. I'm not sure yet. So, you know what? Let's start, let's start with it over here. I think that'll be solid. Um, so, we do have... We do, we do need these logs here. Because I'm going to be making ROM and yeah, it's just, you need a lot of logs. So how about this? Let's, um, let's run this road along here and then the harbor or the, uh, at least here, I'll readjust the road if I need to, but, um, but in all reality, I'm just going to do this. Then if I need that clay deposit, I'll just, uh, I'll go for it then. But, um, so. So let's take the rum here. Um, fire overcame. Good. Let's actually get these buildings back up and running because, uh, yeah. So they vanquished the fire. That's great. Let's go back to the new world. So I want to get this, I want to get Diego RC up and running as soon as possible. Um, because. So actually, did I, did I put the stuff in here already? The advanced, uh, steam. yeah, I did. Okay. So I wanted to get this up and running as soon as possible, actually. Um, because I know that I'm going to need the nice flow of rum coming through here. Um, to sell, to, to fully, I'm using this island to satisfy our rail. And Hawaii will be, you know, Hawaii will be kind of the exception. So, um, that's actually start out with a tractor barn on this um okay so okay so 192 um so the reason i did this is because i wanted to see how big i could make this okay so that's okay that's that so i wanted to actually Oh yeah, I need oil for the tractor barn. I can't just Okay. Alright. So let's let's send this um Let's send this one back to Isle Royale and pick up all the materials I need for the oil here. Um which will be windows, it'll be uh reinforced concrete, which actually Hawaii has a lot of that already. Yeah. Yeah, let's 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 not do that. Let's go back to Hawaii. And get everything I need to set up. Wait, I have an obrero shortage? Because of the sewing machines, I'm guessing. Probably is. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to get the materials there at Hawaii and uh, use that to make the tractor barns here. But in the meantime, in the meantime, I'm going to make this spot here kind of a, you know, a primo... A primo kind of a uh, sugarcane area. I'm just gonna go ahead and make these tractor barns because because it'll be essential here. Okay, that's 181. So if I if I do gather this oil here, it'll go. Um, I'll probably make some sort of path right here and readjust these. Move them over here. But until then, I think I'm gonna. You like this? This has 15 oil on it, and so I can use all of these. I will use all of those, and then I'll use. Um, actually, that's most of it right there. So, I could use this here. 
man, you know, I probably should, but that's my timber output or that's my, I need that area for the, for the logs and stuff. Um, so actually I can run this area. I can move this stuff over here and then run this to possibly an oil harbor here. I'll just have to make some room. I'll make some room here. Yeah, I'll just run the track that way. So I'm glad I got that figured out. So, so I, let's blueprint some of the uh, some of the oil here, the oil refinery. So um, we can put one oil refinery. I'm trying to find a best way to a uh, best way to cover all of these. Okay, I'll have to build three. So that costs a lot of stuff. Um, yeah, so it's gonna cost even more once I add these. So this will supply a lot of oil here actually to Diego Garcia. And I'll probably be able to have quite a surplus to be honest with you. So yeah, um, there's three of them here. Okay, so this one will cost 36. This one will cost 28. And this one will cost 44. Um, that's Yeah, that's going to be a lot of bricks, a lot of steel beams. I don't have enough steel beams right now for that. So let's grab some steel beams here. Um, where are they at? Steel beams are here. Let's get 50 and bring them there. And then uh, reinforce concrete, where are you at? Reinforce concrete, let's get that. And then windows, actually we don't have that many windows. So let's take this stuff back here and then uh, bring windows on something else. Let's send this one, actually let's deposit these. Um, let's send this one to um, Isle Royale and pick up more supplies I need for the tractor barns. But as of right now, I think I, I can build, I really just want to get this oil setup going like right now. That's, that's the biggest thing that I want to do. So the train can kind of take all this here. Um, and then it'll go, I want it to go this way to an oil harbor, which could be there. Yeah, it'll just go straight this way. So what I want to do is take these houses and move them. Man, that would suck if you could do this in real life. Just grab a house and... Well, you kind of can, actually. You can... <laughs> the government kind of can, like... If they're going to build a highway in an area and there's someone's houses on it, like, they can probably just, like, forcibly take the house, maybe, and relocate them. I don't know. Wouldn't be surprised. So, um, let's move this road here. Then we can put a track here. Um... Yeah, I can make this now, actually. This oil harbor um, can take the train here. Oh my goodness, 48. Yeah, well, it was it was bound to happen. I mean, it's... Actually, let's just put it there and connect it. Okay, so the oil is actually almost set up already in Diego Garcia. I didn't think we would get this far with it, to be honest. Like... I really didn't expect it. So, um, let's blueprint some more rum here. Get that tractor barn in here. It's gonna take more steel beams. But yeah, I'm gonna bring back a lot of steel beams and a lot of um, just materials in general for this. Yeah, so that clay really interferes with my with my plan here. I don't like that. That's okay though. So I have three here. Then maybe I can put uh, put some rum here too. Um, I don't know. Um, how about I put actually maybe a cornfield here? Maybe I could do that. If I put it here. Could this be 168? 
Oh, absolutely not. <laughs> nope. Okay, well, I guess this will be like a, um, maybe just a sugar cane plantation that's not enhanced. 113. Uh, maybe that could just be, I don't know, that might be so, that might be a little bit of a void area, which, I don't know, I'll figure out something for it later. But anyways, so I think we our steamer is here with this stuff. So I need windows to to finish off the um, let's do reinforced concrete and then the windows. Where are they at? Here. So I need reinforced concrete, steel beams, and windows to get these refineries going. But that's okay because I can do this. I can at least. I can at least get these farms going. These sugar cane farms, I can at least get those started. Um, let's see, let's put, um, let's kind of line these up here. So I have one, two, three. Okay. I kind of want to link these in kind of a grid fashion. Okay, and then we'll put a uh, put a fire station or two here. Actually, we'll just put it there. Okay, we'll keep it there. Um, so I'm doing this because I wanted to put like uh, some warehouses and fire stations here in this middle section, and then on the other side, I wanted to do more. Well more um, sugar cane um, but also I wanted to link the I have to link the track to the uh, to the fuel depot and the fuel depot I think can just go like right in here so yeah my rum operation will really take off once I get the uh, everything I need going here so I hope I'm bringing in a decent amount of logs too. But yeah, we can we can start the rum up already. Let's do two of them, and then let's put a uh, let's put a warehouse. I can get the most benefit probably. Well, for now, let's put one here, one here. We'll put a fuel depot. Right, a fuel station. We'll put it right here, and then we'll put the track like kind of this way around it, and then this way, and then. Well, no, we should we should bring it this way, right? Or at least weave it up along the edge, I think. And then we'll um yeah yeah so. I wanted it in the middle so it'll reach all these, you know, so it reaches all that. Um, yeah, okay. So Beryl bought another share, did she? Of course she did. So what the hell's going on in Isle Royale to make it just... I'm probably having a shortage of some kind. Worker clothes and fish. Yep, I've already hit that point, so I may as well... Uh, May as well fix it. May as well fix it. Um, yeah, I guess I can just... I don't know. Let's just fix it there. Put two down. Guess we can upgrade this one. So yeah, I, so what I did is last episode... I kind of sort of deleted a few things while I was under the propaganda effect of reduced needs and it kind of screwed me up. So yeah, that was my fault. Okay, so it returned from its voyage. Uh, this steamer, perfect. So I need, uh, what's my windows looking like here? 
My windows here are an amazing, of course. What goods can I buy from her? Um, coffee, rum, chocolate. Okay. What about Mr. Archie? One piece underwear suits. Yeah, steel beams. So I need to buy some steel beams from him. And then... Eli Bleakworth. He... Let's see. What kind of items does he have, actually? Yeah, I'm not going to sit there and fish through his items. I'm sure you guys are grateful for that. So let's go here. Let's actually go to Archie first, grab all those steel beams that he has. He's got 139 of them. Okay. So Diego Garcia is looking really good. Really, really good. Let's make sure there's some uh, seamless travel through here. Um, let's kind of move this to a better location, actually. And then put a warehouse... Uh, how about there? One tick over, actually. And then we'll put the... Put this there, and there, and there. Okay, so this is going to be a nice and organized rum area. Maybe I'll make some clay here too, but I'm not too worried about it. I just have so much clay from other spots that I don't really... I'm not too worried about it. So let's, let's buy... I wonder what she has here that I can buy from her. She requests weapons. Champagne cellar, rum distillery, and advanced rum distillery productivity. Oh, that's actually really nice. Um, I guess I could just buy another cargo ship. Cargo ships are just, you need, you need so many of them. Um, let's buy this item. That's a really good one. Maintenance costs and extra goods. Uh, carpentry works and window makers. Okay, interesting. I don't want that right now, but I'm gonna bring this to um, Diego Garcia And then go to the old world and check on that steamer It should be on its way I'm sure it is it's just Yeah, where is it here? Okay, good. All right, let's move you up there. Hurry up. So Zagynthos is doing fine. I'll rail. Oh my goodness. So it's the fish. The fish, worker clothes. Okay. The fish, the worker clothes, the snap, schnapps. Um, okay. Well, the schnapps is like everything's, it's coming. It's just coming slow. Um, okay. Well, it happens. I guess it'll it'll recover over time. Like, are they starting to come back at all? Supply improving. Supply improving. I guess, yeah. The workers are all coming back. Like, that's not that big of a deal. I'm just missing so much stuff here, you know. What can I get rid of? Yeah, the schnapps is insanely low. I really screwed that one up. It's all right. All right, there we go. One more, okay. Then I have steel beams here, right? Yeah, but I need to bring, actually I can get the windows here. Yep, I'll get them there and then uh, get the hell out. So yeah, schnapps is, um, uh, I hate, the farmer needs really annoy me. They, they really, really do. Cause they're, they just, they just become so, um, they, they feel like they're really trivial later, but like when you're out of the work, when you're out of, uh, farmers, you're out of farmers. Um, let's put this here. Good. Now I have a nice item. Okay. And I'm not making exactly much money right now. I know that, but, uh. At least I'm making some, some uh, rum here. So I have three. We can make one more. So my rum operation is already starting here. And I think um, let's get this. 
Let's get this railway started. I want to make it like as ready as possible. Um, what ship is under attack here? Oh, it's my um. Well, he's up against two ships, so of course he's dead. That's really annoying. So I have to delete some of this stuff or else I'll lose this. Can't lose those items. Alright, coming back here. I know I have I know I've abandoned Crown Falls basically right now. Um but it's it's it, like I'll get back to it, trust me. Um I know my population here is kinda low too. These have kinda kinda came down a bit. Probably because I've been playing a balancing act for a while. Trying to keep them all like in line. Yeah, output stores are full of everything. Yep. Um, let's go to the old world. I will. I promise you, I will get back to Crown Falls. I'm just trying to make sure all my old world needs are met, or my new world needs are met. Um, well, the stuff that I need from the new world to meet the needs of the old world is actually something that I'm a little frustrated about, but um, that's okay. So let's get some windows because I will need a lot of those. And send these to Diego Garcia. And let's go to Diego Garcia and then get back on this uh, blueprint business here. So I wanted to actually run it along here. Oh, actually, no, I can run it. I can run it this way. In fact, I should run it this way. Um. I guess I could do this. Um, yeah, I'll just run it along this road. And then run it... Um, I'll have to move some more houses again. That's okay, though. Don't waste that potential of yours. So it, it, my relationship with George improves, although I'm at war with him. That's interesting. Because I'm pretty sure he he uh, he hates me. Because I bought this island from him. <laughs> Come on. I'm trying to click and drag these houses here. Okay, so. Let's move that up. And the episode... Mm. Sorry about that. The, uh, the episode is actually already over an hour. Man... I get so sucked in with this game, I like forget completely forget where time goes. Like it's just, it's crazy to me. All right, so we got a little one there. Then we can diverge this track to go there. That actually looks just fine. Let's move some back over there. There. Okay, so we can, uh, We'll wait on that, because we do need more windows. Um, but uh, maybe the rum production is... Yeah, it's six here, so... Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. So that other ship is on its way. Um, I do have a quest from her. I have a, another thing for a monitor there. Yep, I'm picking up timber here and bringing it to Hawaii. So Hawaii should actually be... Why might be running full steam? That might be why I'm I'm short of barrows. Because those those rum makers can actually work now, you know. Um, let's go back to the old world and make sure Isle Royale is, is doing okay. Um, okay, so the, some of the workers are back. That's good. Um, but not fully because of the schnapps. So, okay. Okay. Um. I yeah, don't like how disorganized this whole spot is, you know. We put our love into this. Sheep farm, yep. Yeah. 144, yes, yes. Um, okay. So let's I guess we'll just make some we'll make some schnapps here. I, guess, I mean, we kind of have to, right? We don't really have a whole bunch a whole, we don't have much of a choice. Um, so let's put this here. Let's get the 72 going. 
Okay, I need to make sure this my ship isn't getting completely destroyed. Oh, that's a battle cruiser. Your harbor is under attack. My harbor's under attack. Uh oh. Fleet awaiting orders. I'm gonna attack that darn ship of the line. All right, so that is returning. Perfect. Your harbor is under attack. So it should be good here, right? Hawaii is good on this side. I don't know. Maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. Ship under attack. Ship is under attack. Okay. Um, what about this one? Ship under I was not under attack anymore. Attention. So this ship is probably just gonna run. Of course it is, right? There we go. All right, George. Yeah, he has a battle cruiser chilling out over here. So hopefully he comes into range of my cannons because uh, they will screw him up. Ship under attack. Yeah, I'm having my navy come up to get him because this is frustrating. Really, really frustrating. Let's drop off these steel beams. Okay, that might be enough to finish off everything I need um, there, but I doubt it. So why is this fleet so damn slow? It's because of the sails. It's because of the sailing ships. That's why. It's just really, really annoying. Like, come on, get up here. It's just so damn slow. Really, it's like deeply frustrating to me. How slow it is when you when, like you're in a time of need. Like you need this stuff. You know. Let's buy this uh, monitor. Come on. Can we, can we buy it? Thank you. Okay. Um. Oh, he's coming this way now, huh? Let's keep that one there. Um, oh, yeah, 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 I forgot. Um, Jean LaFortune has some stuff for me, too. So a pirate monitor, the Tethys. Another Perforian battlecruiser. Absolutely. No, 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 damn it. Uh, <laughs> it's just one battle cruiser. And this, this, my fleet is so damn slow. Okay. Um, let's put this, uh, let's put one of my, let's put this back on it. Um, Alright, let's let's get that. Let's get that battle cruiser. Of course it'd help if you wouldn't uh if you'd keep up with it. Alright, so I have a ship coming up to help. Trying to slow it down. Oh, I'm, this my battle cruiser is keeping on this, keeping on the, uh, keeping on the pursuit. That's good. There, I'm glad that's. I'm glad I'm taking that out. Good. Good. Now let's keep this. Keep keep my fleet like right here. Yeah, that Perforian battle cruiser costs a lot. <laughs> like a lot, a lot. Um. So let's go back to Diego Garcia. My money is not looking good. I'm going to stop buying ships for a while, I think. Um, let's put the Marigold back on that route. Um, where is the Marigold? There it is. Since the Theseus died. All right, now. Um, I know it's 15 minutes past the hour mark, um, but I just wanted to get one thing done. 
That's still our refinery. Boom. There we go. Now we have oil on Deo Garcia. And I wanted to upgrade that, but first, let's get these tractor barns. Um, let's get this fuel station going. So there, that makes me feel good. We can actually probably move the track like here. So we can get the uh, warehouses squeezed in, I think that would be a good idea. So let's delete those and then move the track here. There. So now let's move a warehouse. We already have one right here, so let's move another one maybe right there. My ship are under attack again. George is killing me. He's so annoying. I know I forgot to pick up these goods here. My ship died like not too far out from here. What ship is it now? It's a George again. He's he's attacking from that side. Um Alright, so George has another ship that's just attacking random things. Let's go take that out. Alright, so um, I'm going to call the episode there. We got our oil going, we got the we got the fuel going for the tractors. Um, it's looking really good. So let's let's um, Okay, they're gonna bring the fuel here to the tractor barns and it's gonna be good. They're gonna be producing a lot. So um, I think those will be able to provide actually for all three. And then I, I desperately need to put something here. I might do another fire station or a trade po a trade union actually. I think it'd be great. Trade union could go. Actually the trade union should go here. In all honesty. Ship under attack. Yeah, but anyways. Attention to the Admiral. Yeah, let's get that guy. He's uh George is really driving me crazy down here. The AI, the, like the AI are just really, they're really strange when they attack. They're just random. They come and fire a few volleys and just leave. Like, okay, screw you, we're gone. Okay, so I wanted to see kind of where, where I'm really hemorrhaging at. Um, Isle Royale is hugely hemorrhaging. Um, Crown Falls is not, like not even close. Isle Royale, though, is, is really, really causing me grief. Because, um... What, what's going on here? A plague or something. So I don't have rum. I don't have a bank. I don't have penny farthings. I don't have the... Okay, so once I, once I get the cotton fabrics here and the rum, I'll be okay. I'll be okay. So I need to put tractor barns on Hawaii as well for the cotton. But I'll solve it. I'll solve it. Anyways, um... So I wanted to say thank you for watching. I know this episode was a bit longer, but I really wanted to get to quite a few necessary things here uh, before I really started going at it. Um, so, yeah. What, what's going on here? Jeez, that's so annoying. So it's under siege, of course. Uh, but I do have some defense here at Mackinac. Yeah, yeah, my harbor's defended. Anyways, I wanted to say thank you for watching. And uh, I appreciate any support you can give. Comment, share, like, subscribe, anything you want to do. If you appreciate my content, I would really, really uh, appreciate it if you could um, support my channel. Could because it's free for you and it helps a little channel like mine a lot. So with that, I will catch you on the next one. Take care.